hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of c if we have 8 to the power of c is equals to 80 and we solve this problem for the values of c so here you see that this is the exponential equation and we find the value of c so uh, in order to solve this exponential equation uh, here we need a logarithm uh, so that we will take uh, the log on both of the sides so after taking this log it will be written as log of 8 to the power of c is equals to log of 80 and here in the next step we use uh, the nice property of log and according to this property of log if we have log of a to the power of m it is equals to m times of log a according to this property of log we write over uh, the left hand side of the above equation as uh, here we move this exponent c in the front of this log and it will be written as c times of log 8 is equals to uh, this is our log 80 and uh, we write this 80 as 10 times of 8 and now uh, further in the next step here we use another property of log in the right hand side uh, so we know that if we have log of a multiplied by b it is equals to log of a plus log of b so according to this property of log we write the uh, right hand side of the above equation as in this form uh, so we have this is c times of log 8 is equals to log of 10 plus log of 8 and now uh, in the next step here uh, in order to find the value of uh, c we need to divide both of the sides by log of 8 uh, so here we divide uh, each of these terms by log of 8 in this form and now here uh, we cancelled uh, these terms and uh, these terms as well uh, and from here we have c is equals to this is a log of uh, uh, 10 and we write this log of 10 as log of 2 multiplied by 5 and here we write this log 8 as a log of we write 8 into the prime factors form and it will be written as 2 cubed and when we cancel this term we get the remaining value is 1 only okay so now here again in the numerator term we apply the second property of log this property and in the denominator we apply this property so here we again use uh, these two properties of log here so after applying the above properties it will be written as we write this term as log of 2 plus log of 5 and here we break this fraction and here uh, first uh, we move this exponent 3 in the front of this log and it will become 3 times of log 2 and here we have this is our plus 1. And now further in the next step we uh, need to break this fraction and when we break this fraction it will become log of 2 divided by 3 times of log of 2 plus this is log of 5 divided by 3 times of log 2 and plus 1. And now here in the next step you see here this term is cancelled out by this term and we get here only 1 over 3 and here we apply another property of log and it will be written as 1 over 3 times of log 5 with base 2 and plus 1. And now here in the next step we need to take the LCM of 1 over 3 and 1 and when we take the LCM it will be written as 4 over 3 and plus from here we have 1 over 3 times of log 5 with base 2 so that from here we get the value of c is equals to 4 divided by 3 plus 1 over 3 times of log 5 with base 2 so this is the final value of c of the given equation so now here in the next step we need to verify this value of c and here we check that uh, is this value of c is satisfied our given question statement or not uh, so that uh, for verification of this value we need to copy down given question statement here it is a to the power of c is equals to 80 and now here we verify uh, this value of c and now we put this value of c in the left hand side of this equation and after substituting this value it will be written as here first we write 
this 8 as 2 cubed and its whole exponent is c and here we put the value of c it is 4 over 3 plus 1 over 3 times of log 5 with base 2 and here we check that is this equals to 80 or not and now here in the next step here we use the uh, exponent law and according to this exponent law we multiply this exponent 3 on each of these values uh, so after multiplying this uh, exponent it will be written as 2 to the power of 3 multiplied by 4 over 3 and plus 3 multiplied by 1 over 3 times of log 5 with base 2 and here we check that is this equals to 80 or not. So here in the next step we need more simplifications and after simplifications we write it as you see here this 3 and this 3 are gone and we get here this is 2 to the power of 4 plus this 3 and this 3 is also gone and we get here log of 5 with base 2 and we check that is this equals to 80 or not and now further in the next step uh, we use here the exponential law and according to this exponent law we break uh, the exponents of these two terms and after breaking the exponents it will be written as 2 to the power of 4 multiplied by 2 to the power of log 5 uh, with base 2 and here we check that is this equals to 80 or not and now here further in the next step uh, here you see that 2 to the power of 4 is equals to 16 and here we apply another property of log and you know about that uh, if we have a to the power of log of b with base a so this is equals to a only so according to this property of log here we can just break these terms and after breaking these terms uh, we will get here only this 5 okay so here we get only 5 and here we check that is this equals to 80 or not and now you see here uh, 16 times of 5 uh, is clearly equals to 80 so we get here 80 is equals to 80 and this shows that uh, the value of c uh, is equals to 4 over 3 plus 1 over 3 times of log 5 with base 2 is satisfied over given question statement so this is the, our uh, final answer of this question and i hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos